everybody. I'm Starla. I'm Mick. And we are Our, our Fair Place, Place Games. Games. Yeah. <laughs> and welcome to our preview of Perch, sponsored by Inside Up Games. Now, family, this game is coming to Kickstarter on August 15th. But here's Starla to give us an overview of this very interesting bird game. Keep your feathered friends close and your enemies closer in Perch, a battle of the birds. Players fight for control of locations by commanding birds of their own and other players' flocks. Earn points and command woodland creatures by having the most birds on a location, pushing your foes off the Perch and breaking ties to take the lead. The game takes place over five rounds. In each round, players will place birds from their own and other players' flocks on locations to earn points, trigger special actions, and take control of creatures. Points are awarded between rounds during the upkeep phase, and the player whose flock has earned the most points by the end of the game wins. With the modular tile configuration and a variety of woodland creatures to control, each game will present a new tactical challenge. Don't let this cozy homestead fool you. Get ready for Winged Warfare. So let's talk about Perch. Yes, and <laughs> the theme is all over this thing. Yes, it is dripping with theme. It's dripping with bird theme. <laughs> yes. Yes. <laughs> yes, yeah, so I, I like that they decided to make all these nice little birds yes. for you to actually perch them. Yes, <laughs> actually perch. And then you also <laughs> perch them on the locations mm -hmm. where they at. And they put them in like trees, on top of buildings. Uh -huh. You know, even electric, you know, wires, yes. these are all in the game. Yes. So where you see a bird perch, even in a fountain, where they perch, they, perch. <laughs> they made a place where they, they made perch. Them perch. Yes. Yeah, so it, they really covered theme, um, and they made sure that the artwork went along with the theme. Yes, they did. The components go yes. along with the theme. So in addition to birds, you've also got other creatures or animals that you're dealing with, such as dogs and a cat and a raven. hawk. A oh, no, it's a, ho no, it's a hawk. It's a yeah, hawk. it's a hawk. Yeah. You know, so you've got all these different creatures that, you know, work along with the birds or sometimes they attack the birds. And, and, and go along with, you know, some of the locations have these really cool, uh, you know, names. Mm -hmm. The early bird mm -hmm. or the fine, the full bird feeder. <laughs> and, and this one is, you know, uh, the peeling yeah. beech, be uh, birch trees. <laughs> I mean, just really cool names yeah. that kind of go along with the mm -hmm. theme of birds and what you'll be like, oh, look at that, a full bird feeder, you know, yeah. something like yeah. you would say, yeah. And then some of the creatures, you got the fox's den, yeah. you've got the dog house, you know, so there are different things here that you're gonna, that are very thematic that yes. go along with yes. birds out in the open, out and, the outdoors. And like this one, the scented, pine trees mm -hmm. or the lonely elk tree yes. or elm excuse me the lonely elm tree yeah. i mean those are some really cool yeah. little names yeah so when you're starting off the game everybody picks their particular color of bird yes. that they yes. like and then you want to decide the best place for you to do your first perch yes and yeah. you know you put out you, you know there's different like locations mm -hmm. and the amount of locations that you put down with these location tiles mm -hmm are going to be determined by player count. Mm -hmm. So it's really cool. So the more players you have, yes. the more locations you get. Yes, and the more war <laughs> of the birds yes. happens. Now, yes. we say war with yeah. the birds, yeah. because when you're perching on a particular spot, you've got three different point values. Yes. So you want to make sure that you get that point value that's going to be the most. And sometimes that may mean, you know, you're going to perch their last, are you going to not perch a lot of birds? You know, because some player may have three birds and you're only going to have two birds and you may get that second value of points on that card. And that's what you want. But sometimes the second or third value on that card, you want that. Yeah. So you got to put, you know, the birds of an opponent there because when you, yes. when you, you, you get different birds where you have to put birds in this migration bag, yes. you put two of your birds in the migration bag mm -hmm. and then all the other opponents put their, the birds in the migration bag. Now, sometimes when you're recruiting, yes. you'll take two out and you'll be probably getting your opponent's birds. Yeah. And you, you don't can, always get your birds. Yes, and you can <laughs> use them how you feel fit 
to use yeah, them. So, yeah. So when you're pulling out of the bag, you get two out of the bag, and then you get two from your own supply. Yes. And when you're going to these different places to perch, like I was saying before, you know, you may want to perch more of your birds there than the opponent's birds so that you can get the most points. Or you may want to perch more of your opponent's birds there if you have them so they can get the least amount of points. Whatever's going to work in your favor, yes. that's the strategy on how you're going to perch your birds and where you perch your birds. And because ultimately you want to get to this fountain sometimes yes. so you can get more points while building yourself up on yes. the fountain. Yeah, because the fountain board allows you to go up the uh, fountain and we get to the top that's the most points so you want to start getting birds over here so that they can get up the fountain and get you some points but sometimes you, uh, some of these uh, you know locations will make you go to the plaza down at the bottom you don't want to be that's the just plaza. one point mm -mm. but then at the end of the game you know if you know yeah. you, you look into the, the migration bag and those birds that still left over in your color they get, you know, 1.2, yeah, they, they, get, go, to the they go to the plaza. Yeah. So sometimes yeah. that can't work it if you can't have a lot help in if there. you got a lot of birds in there. Yeah. But you got five rounds. So yes. five rounds, you got to make it happen. You got to make it happen. You got to make quickly. your bird the yes. top bird. Yes, and it's it's a real quick game. It's, it's not a quick it don't game. it don't take forever. Yeah, yeah. It's easy to learn yeah. because the you know a lot of the locations have you know all the they, written words. They tell you, words what, on, what you need they to tell do. you yeah, what's they tell going you. on yeah. with it, you know, and what turn because you know you have a few mm -hmm. uh, different things you have to do on your turn, mm -hmm. and they'll tell you during upkeep. You know, this is what happens. Yeah. You know, with your birds on mm -hmm. upkeep, or when you start off, you know, migration yeah, round or something. Right. It, it just tells and every you what's round going you're, on. you're getting points. So every round you're going to tally up your points before you go to the next round and that helps you decide what you're going to do on the next round because if your points are low and all your opponents got more points than you you got to say okay i got to do something different this next round so i can bring my points up yes and one thing we haven't talked about yet are the creatures the creatures you want to recruit creatures yes. because they can help you get your opponent's birds out the yes. way or move your bird to a better spot or get so, you into the fountain exactly yes. so these creatures are important so you want to work to recruit them. And now the creatures are very thematic. They you know, are. like a cat. You have a cat, they chase away birds. They chase away birds. You know, yeah. then you have a dog that chase away birds. <laughs> yeah. You know, you have all these different, yeah. and you know, they all move mm -hmm. in different, you know, ways. Yeah. And so you want to control some creatures mm -hmm. because also at, on end game points, because mm -hmm. you have objective cards too. Sometimes the objective cards say, hey, at the end of the game, you got to control at least two creatures. Mm -hmm. And so sometimes you got to hustle to try to get those you creatures do that. to yeah. fulfill your objectives. And so, to get more points. And get to more points. Yeah, to get yes. more points. Yes. So overall, this game is all about the birds. You're all about <laughs> birds. <laughs> and how you perch them and how in you, different locations. <laughs> and how you fight and get with each other. But it's yes. not too mean, but it is kind of sort of. A little mean. It, it can be mean, especially yeah. when you're in control of your opponent's bird yes. and you put them someplace that you know is not going to be advantageous yes. and for them. And that opponent looking at you and like, the really? Not happy. Really? That's what you're going to do with my bird? <laughs> And yeah. you had to give up because Stalo was like, why do you have my bird? Because I know he's going to do something bad. Yes, he's, I'm going he's, to do something gonna be, bad. He's not going to be nice and try to no, help me. No, I'm not. It's so, going to help me. So when he's recruiting birds out of the bag, yes. I am going, please don't pick my bird. Please don't yes, pick my bird. I want your bird. I don't well, want you did the same thing to me. Yeah, I don't mind picking your bird. I'm, I'm helpful. I try to help you. No, you didn't. No, you didn't. Because see, first, you always say, ooh, I got this stinky bird. I'm like, why are you going to talk about my birds? Yes, and I would put him in places that I knew would get him zero points. See, that, that's not even right, family. <laughs> and she did do that yeah. to me. So so that's really the game of perks. Yes, it is. You are taking your birds, putting them in different locations, recruiting other creatures to help move your birds or move your opponent's birds out of the way. And and, and the little birds, they stack up. Yes, you this is in the, uh, you know, you have some have nests. Yeah. And nests count plus yeah, one sometimes. Sad. Well, all the like times when they're there in on one of the tiles, because the tiles will tell you to put a uh, nest there. They'll have it in the corner. But this is how they stack up. So they it's really up. cool. It's so really that cool. that is the game of perch. Yes. Now, family is coming to Kickstarter on August fifteenth. Now, don't take our word for it. Like we always say, check it out for yourselves and see if your family or your game group mm -hmm. might like it. Now, I also want to say this is a prototype. prototype. So. A lot of things, especially the birds and maybe some mm -hmm. of the other little yep. components that come along, will change. Just want to let you know that. Now, Starla, where can they find OFPG out here and with all the birds? All where the bird, are the birds all at? The birds. 
Yes. Oh, I hope they don't attack us like that that Hitchcock yeah, film, The Birds. Oh, the Attack of the Birds. Well, know. if you're looking for Our Family Plays Games, yes. you can find us on Facebook, yes. Instagram, uh -huh. Twitter, yes. and right here on YouTube. Right here. And TikTok. TikTok, TikTok. All right, family. Thank you so much for checking out our preview of Perch. Perch. And this is sponsored by Inside of Games. So definitely check it out on their Kickstarter. So if you have any questions or comments, definitely put it down below. But like we always say, we love you. Bye, Bye now. Everybody.